welcome to our channel in this video we should learn the computation of arithmetic mean of individual series under different methods so let's start so our given series is 3 6 12 27 15 21 30 and 18 in this series we should find out arithmetic mean under different methods that means we should find out arithmetic mean under direct method and the arithmetic mean under shortcut method and the arithmetic mean under step deviation method so you should solve one by one so first come to our direct method so the arithmetic mean under direct method is that is arithmetic mean or which is denoted as x bar is our summation of x divided by n so first of all we have to find out summation of x that is 3 plus 6 plus 12 plus 27 plus 15 plus 21 plus 30 plus 18 so our total of x or total of the variables is 132 so our arithmetic mean equals to summation of x that is 132 divided by n that is the number of items 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 so in the given series our n is 8 so our arithmetic mean equals to 132 divided by 8 equals to 16.5 so the arithmetic mean under a direct method of the individual series or of the given series is our 16.5 now we should find out the arithmetic mean of the given individual series under shortcut method so for the purpose of shortcut method we should find out d or the deviations that is the difference between our given variables and the assumed mean so let's take the assumed mean of the given series is our 15 the deviation should be x minus 15 that is 3 minus 15 equals to minus 12 6 minus 15 that is minus 9 12 minus 15 that is minus 3 27 minus 15 12 15 minus 15 0 21 minus 15 that is 6 30 minus 15 that is 15 18 minus 15 that is 3 so now we should find out summation of d are the summation of deviations so our plus minus should be cancelled and our total of the summation of a d that is our 12 now we should find out the arithmetic mean under shortcut method by applying the rules that is a plus summation d by a so here assumed mean is our 15 plus summation d that is 12 divided by n is our 8 so 15 plus 12 divided by 8 equals to 1.5 so the arithmetic mean is 
5. So, the arithmetic mean on our shortcut method of the given individual series is our 16.5. Now, we shall find out the arithmetic mean of the given individual series under step deviation method. So, for the purpose of step deviation method, we should find out D dash, that is D divided by the common factors of the given variable. So, here the common factor of the given variables is our 3. So, D dash equals to D divided by 3. So, our D dash is minus 12 by 3, that is minus 4. Minus 9 by 3, that is minus 3. Minus 3 divided by 3, minus 1. 12 divided by 3, 4. 0 divided by 3, 0. 6 divided by 3, 2. 15 divided by 3, 5. 3 divided by 3, that is 1. So now, we should find out summation of D dash. Similarly, plus 1, minus should be cancelled. And our total or the summation of D dash should be 5 plus 2, 7, minus 3, that is 4. Now, we should apply the rules of arithmetic mean order step deviation method. That is arithmetic mean or x bar equals to a plus summation d dash by n into i. So now putting the values that is here a is our 15 plus summation d dash that is 4 divided by n is 8 into i that is 3. So, by simplifying 15 plus 4 divided by 8, that is 1 by 2. So, 3 by 2, that is 15 plus 1.5 equals to 16.5. So, the arithmetic mean of the given individual series under step deviation method is 16.5. So, these are all about the computation of arithmetic mean of individual series under direct method, shortcut method and step deviation method. So, repeatedly watch this video to clear your doubts or to develop your knowledge on the computation of arithmetic mean of a individual series and share it with all your friends in order to give them opportunity to enhance their knowledge on computation of arithmetic mean of a individual series under different methods. Thank you.